Hey, Rick, how does BitTorrent actually work? All right, Morty, imagine downloading a file not from one place, but from hundreds of people at once. That's BitTorrent. It's a peer-to-peer -peer protocol, which means everyone shares pieces of the file and everyone's downloading and uploading at the same time. So it's not like a regular download? Exactly. Normally, you download from a central server. But with BitTorrent, there's no single server. Instead, the file is split into chunks. And as soon as you get a chunk, you start sharing it with others, too. Who decides what to download? You get a torrent file, basically a roadmap of what the full file looks like and where to find it. Then your BitTorrent client connects to a tracker, which helps it find other people, called peers who have the file. What are seeders and leechers? Seeders are people who have the entire file and are sharing it. Leechers are still downloading, but they also upload the pieces they've got. The more seeders, the faster and healthier the swarm. And why is it so fast? Because instead of getting one file from one place, you're getting multiple chunks from different peers simultaneously. Think of it like assembling a Lego set by pulling pieces from a hundred people at once. And is it illegal? BitTorrent itself? Nope. It's just a protocol. But yeah, people do use it to share pirated stuff, which is illegal. There are also tons of legal uses, like distributing Linux distros or game updates without crushing a central server. So it's efficient, but risky? Yep, super efficient, super decentralized, but you gotta watch what you're downloading, or you'll end up with viruses, or worse, a DMCA notice in your inbox. And before you swipe, leave a like and a follow, or I'm gonna send you to another dimension.